Hey. Welcome back, everybody. We're here with John Hunt with Quest Aircraft, and we're going to be talking about the Quest Kodiak. I'll turn around this way for just a second, yeah. John. We got the sun on our face. It's early morning here, so it's a little tough to get in. But uh, let's uh, let's step over to this airplane yeah, and uh, we'll take a look at it. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and talk about the uh, the Quest Kodiak aircraft here. Or yeah. Yeah. So the Kodiak was, uh, the, our first year of production was 2008. We're celebrate, celebrating a decade of improvements. Uh, getting close to building our 250th airplane, which will occur sometime this summer. Very good. We've got a global footprint. The aircraft is uh, flies all over the world, China, uh, Southeast Asia, Africa, South America. So flies all over the world, and it's a very versatile aircraft. Yeah. It's used for operations such as here in North America, owner flown, business. Uh, aviation and we get into commercial operations and it is the fastest um, seaplane currently being produced as well which we have one sitting behind us. Excellent. Yeah. Oh awesome we'll go take a look yeah. at that in a little bit. Yeah. Uh, how about uh, the the fun stuff the fun information how about uh, the horsepower things like that? 750 horsepower this is uh, has the Garmin G1000 it was the first single engine turboprop to have such uh, you see some of the neat features we have in here. It's got the, the auto level button. Uh, we were the first single engine turboprop to have that feature introduced from Garmin. GFC 700. Uh, it's It's got all the bells and whistles. All right, is this aircraft intended for crew operations or single pilot operations or a mix? It is, it is intended for single pilot operations. Uh, it, it, there are a total of 10 seats, uh, pilot plus nine uh, passengers. It can be configured for air medical operations, skydive operations. This one is configured in an executive interior. Uh, it can uh, it can also be used to carry cargo. Oh, excellent! Let's take a look at the executive interior. Sure. Okay, so it looks like we've got uh, five five passengers, two crew members. This one is it is configured with the uh, summit interior. It has five standard seats. We could put an optional sixth seat at the door. Mm -hmm. Very good. And then uh, as far as cargo is concerned, how yeah, this is the cargo shelf. It can carry up to 200 pounds of cargo right here. This one is also equipped with the optional cargo pod. You can carry 750 pounds of cargo. And uh, as a single engine turboprop, I would recommend anybody has one of these, you get TKS for a flight into known icing. This one is equipped, uh, obviously it has a TKS panels here with TKS in uh, the pod. You can fly for up to two and a half hours in icing conditions. Very good. And this just uh, has little tiny micro holes that weep out the TKS anti-icing fluid. Correct? That's correct. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Well, all right. Well, John, thank you very much for your time, and uh, we hope you have the best of luck here at, at Sun Fun 2018. Thank you very thank much. Thank you very much. If you're here at the show, come out and see us. All right. Excellent. And what booth is this? This it's, is, we're out by the flight line, right by the excellent. flight line, and where the air show is with the chalets. Excellent. And there's also very good ice cream just up next to them, so come by and get some ice cream, too. All right. Thank you very much for joining us. We'll be back with more later.